Welcome to Tech Notice. In this video, I'd like to review this PFY Focus, which is a wireless follow focus system, but it's much more than that. So without no further ado, let's jump into the video. Are you using a Windows 10 operating system and haven't activated it yet? Then click on the link in the description and purchase a Windows 10 OEM license from your cdkey.com and let's get that problem sorted. Once you've completed the purchase, the activation is easy. Hit the Windows key, type in activation and hit enter. Click on change product key, copy it from your purchase order, paste it in the product key box, click next, then activate and you're all done. Use the code TN20 to get a 20% discount on your order. Find out more about your cdkey.com, links and discount codes in the description. So, as you can see over here, I've got this set up already with my PFY Maverick. And uh, as you can see, if I turn the wheel, the follow focus is all working over here. And to prove you that is wireless, you know, I can have the remote in my hand. And can you see that? It is still working. So let me talk a little bit more what you can do with this PFY focus and why I think this is a pretty good idea if you're looking into a wireless focus follow focus systems or even zoom systems then why you should purchase this or what can it do so very quickly let me just start with some of the specs and um, so this wireless follow focus system it works on a 2.4 gigahertz frequency just so you know and if you have any other devices that are on the same frequency and also it has a 50 meters of wireless range, which is pretty cool. Quickly gonna go over what's inside the box. If you wanna see the unboxing experience, um, then click up there where I'm unboxing the gimbal and with the actual follow focus system. So you can buy the system separately, as well as with a gimbal as a combo. So if you just want to buy it separately, you can see that the price is 399 usually, but at the moment there is a deal where there's 100 euros off. Or depends where you're buying from and I'm also gonna see if I can find the uh, discount code that I can leave in the description so if you're interested in getting a discount just check out the description below but uh, inside the box you're gonna get this nice little pouch here that has three other pouches inside so there you go over here obviously inside the circle one you have the remote wheel and on the other one you have some of the cables that I still have inside over here. And as you can see, there is a lot of it. All the cables that you possibly can think of, you're gonna get with it. So you don't have to worry, oh, am I gonna get this, this cable for my camera or for this, or for D-tap to the actual power of this? It's all included, there's, there's loads of it. I've got some more over here. So that's that. Then inside the other one is the, uh, motor over here and that is pretty much it if you're gonna buy it with a gimbal i can't remember if you're gonna get it also when you get the wireless follow focus separately but there is also lens support over here and there's a belt on the lens that you're gonna get as well the uh, nice thing is that the remote also comes with the nice um fixing if you have one of those fixings you know either your shoulder mount or you can put the fixing over there and then the remote just literally slides in tighten up and that's how simple it is um, if you're wondering what type of fixing it is it's the type of fi fixing that's on the side of the tripods usually but there's a quarter inch inside and then like these little teeth on the side just to so you can actually make it go around all the way uh, however you mount it or however you please to have this wire wireless follow focus on the side so if you still don't know when to use it or what do you want to use it for then let me just quickly break out that kind of barrier as well so you can use it as a wireless follow focus so pull focus you know like that you can use this as a zoom as well so if you have some kind of a zoom lens and you want to get a really smooth zooms then you can pull the zoom as well now if you have two of these systems and you maybe you want to rig out two you can use zoom and focus both at this well not same time but you know separately so you can use them on the same rig and also, you don't have to necessarily use it on a PFY gimbal. You can use it on a PFY Maverick, PFY Adventure, or H2 series, and because they have like the support of an output to power the motor. But if you want to use it on a like a shoulder mount or like a big cinema mount where you've got your big camera, big lens, and a V mount battery, then you can actually use it on there as well because you just power the motor uh, via V lock or 
however way you want it. It just needs 7 to 15 volts, so it's very like a big range of power that you can put into it, which is very, very, very useful. So it's up to you how you want to use it or where you want to use it, which kind of system you want to use it. They've leave it up to you and you can use it. One more thing that I forgot to mention that's inside the box is this carbon fiber rod over here. You can see over that, that over here is included in the box as well, as well as the cold shoe fixings. If you want to fix this rod into the cold shoe, or if you want to fix it straight onto a, like, you know, if you've got rails going on already in your shoulder mount, then you can just straight away fix this motor onto that. So you've got this, this fixing and as well. But now let's talk about what you can do with it. So this little remote over here is quite a smart little one over here. You've got these two little knobs over here. Can you see that? these two little knobs over here and you can move these around move these around and then actually set your hard points okay i want this to focus end here and the other one to end here and boom as you can see hard end here and hard end over there okay let's go a step further now if you're using this on a gimbal like this one or not necessarily and um, you can connect your camera if you have a panasonic canon or sony to the motor and you can start and stop recording of the camera on this remote. So there's two more buttons on the remote over here. You press start and it starts recording. Also on the bottom there is a zoom, little zoom button as well. If you have one of those power zoom lenses, for example from uh, Zoni, it's called Sony Lowry, S S S Sony, then you can use this little button on the bottom of this remote to kind of use it as the, the power zoom lens, which, which is cool as well. This little remote is powered by a micro USB cable and just use a power bank or any of the USB outlets and boom, you can charge it up because there's a built-in battery over here. As you can see on the bottom of the plate on this remote, there are quarter inch screw holes, quite a few of them. If you want to mount it any other way, there you go. Now that is not it. Calibrating and everything else inside is very, very easy. You've got this um, little menu inside the remote here, which is very easy to operate and then decide what you want to do. There's a few settings over there, but the main thing also that you can do with this is a focus lap. So basically there's a focus, focus lapse setting where if you want to use it with your gimbal or you know, on a tripod, you can use the focus lapse and then just stack focus and get everything in focus. You know what focus lapse is. So one thing I'd like to mention is that if you're going to look at the uh, advert or the website on this, then you can see probably that this white ring is like neon green or like it lights up, but actually it's just for like the pictures. It doesn't actually light up. It's just white. Okay. And then you can take this ring off if you don't want it and have like a bit more finger kind of estate on this wheel. So the, the wheel is very nice and smooth and like a kind of good um, tension on it. So you're not pulling it too fast or accidentally pulling it. So it's really nice and zoom. So, you know, so it's kind of nice to work it, things like that. So now you know what it can do. Let me give you some of my opinion now. Straight away when you take it out of the box and you can see everything is kind of like a, I don't know, industry standard. And I like these little boxes that you get with it. Makes it feel very professional. All the cables that provided is everything's packed inside these things. It's very, very nice. Everything just, just works. And the biggest thing for me is, are you able to use it straight away out of the box? And I can tell you that this just work straight out of the box. So all I'm going to do is turn on the gimbal, turn on the camera and the motor is already powered on because it gets the power from the gimbal. The last thing I'm going to do is turn on this motor and it's automatically connected to the motor. If you have any connection issues, it's very easy to do that. Uh, you know, center button and motor and then just connect this while holding that button on the bottom over here that's inside on the motor and then boom, it connects up. If it's connected, you can see there's this little green button over there, not button, light over there and boom, off you go, you are connected. That light just died. If you want to calibrate the wireless follow focus, I thought, oh, calibrating, how does this work? It's super, super easy. You can do it a few different ways. You can do it by like hand or remote. I prefer the remote. So basically I'm going to click on uh, calibrate. Once you press remote, you press start and then you can by these little arrows over here, you can move the motor. So just look at your lens where you can see, you know, if it's the very closest focusing distance or furthest, you can see your focus. Hit down one of those arrows and then let it go all the way to the other point. 
maybe a little bit over so you can actually know that you can pull it to the maximum point and a little bit further and then press OK and then go all the way to the other side OK and then OK again, boom and then all your motor is perfectly calibrated. So when you go out over here and you can see these, there is a, like a percentage over here, go in the middle, it perfectly works. It just works, it just works. So now if you're wondering, is it a good price to pay for it? I think it is because if you look at some of the like other companies that produce wireless follow focuses, then they're very similar price. And I don't see why you shouldn't buy this because it's very much out there and you get like extra features inside and you can connect your camera with it, which is very useful. And um, if you want to do that, like for example, if I'm going to shoot this video over there and have this wireless follow focus over there, I can actually start recording my camera by this button, boom, over there, and that camera starts recording or stops recording. Who is this for? This is for the people who want to take their filmmaking to the next level and want to actually try to kind of take the first step into the feature filmmaking or where filmmaking is to the professional level and you need to pull the focus and things like that. It's very, very cool. Also for these people who are already in that kind of market and they're producing feature films and producing very high quality cinematic stuff that needs these types of wireless, you know, focuses and maybe you've got another person assigned to do that job, then I per definitely would recommend checking out this because it's a very good budget option for a very professional user or someone who wants to just play around and maybe get some extra features for your PFY gimbal, then this is a perfect option for you. If you're interested in that, the link is in the description. Also, if you have any other questions, leave a comment below. I'm gonna meet you in the comment section and do my best to answer all your questions. Found this video helpful? Hit that like button, hit that subscribe button if you'd like to see more videos like these and I'll see you in the next one. Thanks guys for watching. I'll see you soon. Adios.